And there, Peter, is Max Fried trying to get his seventh win of the season. Tommy Edmond is the batter. The center fielder is two for eight in the series with a pair of doubles. 2-0 pitch is rifled into center and a good start for the Cardinals offense. Third hit of the series for Edmund. Max Fried coming off the 10 strikeout performance against the Dodgers looking for his first here tonight against St. Louis. And he's got 97 right by Paul Goldschmidt. Tried to go away again and pulled a little bit but when it's 97 Goldie must have been looking for something off speed with a swing that late. But right now it's Max Fried trying to polish off the Cardinals in the top of the first. Runner goes. Darno with a good strike down to second. And Tommy Edmund is out. And they will not look at this. That ends the inning. No runs, one hit. No errors, none left. We play to have an inning. Cardinals nothing. Adam Wainwright getting the start for St. Louis. It's going to be an emotional night for him back in his home state for the final time as a major league pitcher. Getting a chance to go at it against the team that drafted him, the team that he grew up cheering for. You know this is a big moment for Wayno. And not an easy assignment for him. The Atlanta offense is power packed. He gets greeted rudely by Ronald Acuna Jr. It is gone. One pitch. And Atlanta has the lead. That's the 11th home run he's allowed over the last 39 and two thirds of an inning. It's already been a tough year for Adam and that just got a little bit worse. Ronald wasting no time. One nothing Braves. But a four pitch walk. Well, the Braves trying to take control of this one early tonight. This man Matt Olson has had a nice series including a pair of homers. Right center field this one's going to get down. Matt has a double sliding head first. So Atlanta's gone. Homer walked double here to start in the home half of the inning. Wainwright's thrown three strikes in the inning. The Braves have two hits and the lead. Now Ozuna with 33 homers. That one good enough. It freezes Ozuna. Strike three on the outside corner. There's the first out of the inning. And Eddie Rosario will come up to face him now with one away. Eddie line drive. Base hit. Matt's going to try to score. Walker's throw is nowhere near. A three to nothing lead. With the three runs here in the first inning, Atlanta sets a new franchise record for runs in a first inning in a season. Previous record was 127. Atlanta is now at 129. Michael Harris now. Sharply hit to second, but a one hopper will end the Atlanta first. A leadoff homer for Ronald Acuna Jr. Rosario singles home two more, and after one, the Braves strike first. So Atlanta got three in the bottom of the first inning, and the Cardinals try to strike right back. Walker goes second to third, one station ahead for everybody. Now the bases are loaded with one down. For Andrew Kisner, who's 0 for his last 15. Full count. He hit him. Walker will score to make it a 3-1 game. Andrew Kisner comes all the way back from 0-2 to earn a painful RBI. The back knee, and they might have clipped Travis as well on the forearm and the chest. That's a triple banger. On the road trip, Atlanta routinely was getting six innings from their starter, but so far in this series, Soroka only lasted three. Strider two and two-thirds. And Max in a little bit of trouble here in the second inning. Good pitch. Max Freed with a changeup that fools Mason Wynn for the second out. I need one more out anywhere is Tommy Edmond. Pitch number 30 of the inning. Line drive, center field base hit. One run scores. Here comes Gorman. Harris is thrown to the plate. It's going to be in time. Oh, Gorman was halfway across the plate when the tag was made. The Cardinals are going to check this. We've got a 3 2 game for the moment. Did he get him on the elbow? No, he didn't get him. I don't think he got him at all. Either that hand of Gorman appears to be in there. The call of out is overturned. Runner's safe. So review got it right. Tommy Edmond gets two RBIs. Two balls, two strikes for Albies. 3-3 game, the pitch. Straw came out. Top of the zone. Bueno gets a call. And the duel is on in Atlanta. A shutdown inning for Adam. Braves have only been swept in a three-game series twice this year. Trying to avoid that here tonight against an unlikely candidate. 2-2 to Arenado. Swing and a miss. Two away. Let's see where he goes with the 0-2. Trying to go back inside. It ends up down in the zone. Good throw by Nicky Lopez. And a 1-2-3 top of the third for Max Free. A one-out walk to Gorman. And that is two walks plus a hit by pitch. This should help. On to the bottom of the fourth, the pitcher's best friend, 6 4 3. Marcia, who's followed Dansby Swanson as the Braves' primary shortstop. This guy's only made one throwing error all year. One. He struck him out and went to an E. Wayno comes back to get Arcia. His third strikeout 
And Nicky Lopez is up. Little ground ball towards second since the first inning hit. Atlanta's offense 0 for 11 at the plate against Wayno. Here's a 2 2. Got the call on the inside corner. Tommy Edmond in disbelief. Ollie Marble also in disbelief. Probably a good thing Ollie's not mic'd up. The Cardinals have something brewing here at the top of the fourth inning with two down. Neal with a single, Goldsmith with a single. And here is Nolan Arenado. Michael gets to it, takes it from Ronald, and we stay tied at three. We're halfway home. Time of the order for the Braves. It's a 3 3 ball game here in the bottom of the fifth inning. Edmund going back up against the wall, leaps up, head hauls it in. Another great fence grabbing catch by Tommy Edmund. Adam Wainwright is clapping. This guy is incredible in center field. Going, still going, still going, and another one. Another one up against the wall. And all Wainwright can do is chuckle. Well, maybe Matt Olson will put it where nobody can catch it. This ball left center field. Is that going to go? Hey, guess what, Edmund? You're not getting that one. Homers in four straight games for Matt Olson, and Atlanta is back in front. That's his 47th home run of the year. And more importantly, the Braves take a 4-3 lead here in the fifth. And back out there for the sixth inning to face 5-6-7 in this cardinal order. Is that fastball in again? That's a strike tonight. Come on. Look it up. Get out. Get out. Get out. He's either shooing away a cat or. No, nope, that's Ollie. Ollie Marble's just been ejected by Laz Diaz. I think it was Ollie. It's been a tough night for Laz, I'll be honest, but his patience has obviously worn a little bit thin. We think it may have been hitting coach Turner Ward that was ejected after all of that. Michael Harris over toward the gap, takes that. Walker's 0 for 3. Now the lefty lefty matchup. Ground ball. Olsen is there. Beautiful. And free, beautiful indeed. He gets through six. Michael Harris leading off the home half of the sixth. In the air, deep right. That may be ain't coming back. Money Mike gives the Braves a 5-3 lead. Into the chop out, his 14th of the year. And he just missed a homer in the fourth inning. Here in the sixth inning, he lets it fly. And Atlanta with a two-run cushion. And he does it on Money Mike headband night. He's at 103 pitches. Well, I think this is out of respect for him, right? I mean, you've got a team that 61 and 78, but you've got a guy who has meant so much to this organization for so long. Ronald Acuna right center field. Gone! Second of the night for Ronald. And for Acuna, it's home run number 34 on the year. I think they finally got the memo. You don't want Edmund to catch him, hit him over the wall. This is a big moment for Adam Wainwright. Grew up in Southeast Georgia, a huge Atlanta Braves fan, drafted by the Braves, ultimately traded to the Cardinals, 18 seasons with them, and that is the final time that he will tow the rubber in the state of Georgia. Brings in Travis Darno, who's 0 for 3. Right center field off the bat of the catcher, Darno. There's another one. Atlanta has launched 11 homers in the series now. And for Travis, it's his 11th of the season. And Atlanta has opened it up. And now Rice Saliglasi is coming out there. What an August it was. The National League Reliever of the Month in August. And now Michael Harris reaches up and takes potential extra bases away from Jordan Walker to start the ninth inning. So 11 in a row set down now for Braves pitching so the bases are loaded Cardinals got all three of their runs in the top of the second inning but now they are threatening to score again here in the top of the ninth. Line to the center there's a base hit for a win one run will score the Cardinals will bring the tying run to the plate in the ninth inning it's an 8 4 game swing and a fly ball he just missed it Gorman will tag at third now an 8 5 ball game after the sack fly by Edmund Tyler O'Neill has a homer in the series let's see if he can tie it up line drive here Eddie over yes that ends the ball game a spectacular diving catch by Eddie Rosario and the Braves salvage the series with an 8 to 5 win.